Welcome to SJE Detroit Lakes. Let's take a look around. We're starting with the engineering labs where engineers can do accelerated product life cycle testing and development of new product ideas. Next, we move to the printed circuit assembly area. Here we have the pick and place machine, which places parts, the reflow oven, which heats the solder to attach them, and the automated optical inspection machine, which inspects the part placement, solder quality, and compares that to the gold standard. We employ multiple different soldering techniques in the plant, such as reflow, wave solder, selective solder, a soldering robot, and hand soldering. The printed circuit assembly process ends with programming and testing of each board. Our raw materials warehouse contains the inventory needed to produce the products we make. In the production area, we utilize many machines and automated processes to aid in assembly and reduce labor time, such as this CNC machine, which cuts different shapes and sizes of holes in our non-metallic enclosures. This backplate printer labels backplates for components and wiring connections. We use vertical lift modules, or VLMs, which are high-density part storage and retrieval systems. These allow us to pick up to eight shop orders simultaneously, many having multiple panels each. They use a laser pointer and a visual display indicating part number, description, and quantity, and which kit gets which picked parts. Once picked, the finished kits await assemblers to build the panels. We also make use of pre-cut wire kits for repeatable builds. The wire prep area has multiple pieces of semi-automated equipment to cut and terminate the wires. In the panel areas, we use electronic work instructions for all repeatable builds, as well as templates for lower to medium volume repeatable builds. Each workstation is equipped with the tools and supplies needed to assemble the panels in the area. Now moving to the float switch manufacturing area, we've deployed robotics to do some of the monotonous tasks such as the Yumi here, putting parts on the Corona treater. These robots are building float housings and cable weights. And this is a new automated assembly line currently under development. All of these were developed in-house. Along with robotics, we have many specialty machines that assemble or prep parts for our float switch manufacturing. We have cut strip machines, cable coilers, terminal crimpers, and injection molders in the cord set area. We also have multiple types of plastic part welders, such as hot plate welders, spin welders, and ultrasonic welders. Here's an automated tester that the team developed in-house.
Once products are completed, they make their way to central packaging where they may be bagged, boxed, or bulk packaged. This is one of the boxing labeling lines. In our shipping warehouse, we stock panels to be picked for orders on a new mezzanine and house other finished goods in the pallet racking. Our training room is a gathering place for meetings, customer trainings, learning about products, and company history. It also displays the product patents SGE has obtained over the years. For more information about SJE's history, go to the link seen here.